it's your girl Renee and today I am going to be reviewing two new Sally Hansen products. The first one is Sally Hansen Insta Gel Strips. So it's a gel manicure starting kit and it has two steps. You just put the strip on and then you put it in under the mini LED lamp and you're done. I haven't even opened up the box yet um, but it looks fairly simple. I know that, generally speaking, I don't wear anything on my hands because I'm a mom, I'm washing dishes, I'm doing errands, my nails tend to chip and I don't like the way that looks and it irritates me and then I have to try and take it off and find time to do that. It's too much, so I don't deal with regular um, nail polish very often, maybe on special occasions. So gel manicures I've had in the past at salons and I've really liked them because they last much longer than a regular manicure and they rarely chip so I like the strength of them it's almost like having acrylic on your nails but but not um, so let me just show you out of the box what this looks like a little bit difficult to open and yes I'm in my kitchen because it's the easiest place for me to give myself a manicure, which I'm going to do, and then I'm gonna show you the results. So you have a little adapter in here. You have the gel strips. I don't know if you've seen my review, but I have done the little strips that you put on your nails, which I, I like those actually. And these are very reminiscent of that. They're the, they come in the little packages. They have the little nail file and tool. And then this is another extra step. This is the nail cleanser pad, which I'm assuming you use to clean your nails before you apply the manicure strips. And then you have the mini LED lamp. I think that's really cute. So basically I'm gonna do my individual fingers. And finally, you have the gel itself. So this is the top coat and you put that on. So I have not read all the instructions, but just looking at what I have here, I would say that clean your nails, put the strips on, put each one under, then put the top coat on, put each one under, and voila, fabulous nails. At least that's what I expect to happen. So I'm gonna do that on one hand. On the other hand, I'm going to try the new gel polish, gel manicure starter kit. So you see it comes in this, and it's a much bigger package. That's kind of like the instant packaging, instant manicure. This is a little bit more detailed. Um, and it contains a six watt LED lamp, four millimeter, a milliliter gel base coat, seven milliliter gel nail color, and four milliliter gel top coat, 10 nail cleanser pads, acetone remover, which is necessary. Let me tell you, if you've never had gel nails before, getting them off, it's a little bit of a hassle. Uh, because it's so strong on your nails, it takes a little while for it to come off. And generally speaking, using 100% acetone and soaking your nail in that is what will help to get them off. It takes a little while, but I guess you just have to balance, you know, weigh your choices. Do you want a manicure that's going to come off fairly easy but only last for a few days, or do you want a manicure that's going to last up to two weeks? I take the two weeks and taking it a little bit more time to get it off, actually. And then it comes with a cuticle stick, file, and buffer. So let me show you what it looks like. So here is the actual packet. That's actually pretty jazzy, if you ask me. And it gives you the step-by-step -step instructions right on here. You put on the base coat, and then you cure for 30 seconds. You put on the color, and you cure for 30 seconds. You put the top coat, you cure for 30 seconds, and you're done. And the thing is, because this has a larger LED lamp, you can do all your fingers at the same time. So honestly, I don't know which one will be faster, but I'll let you know. I, I think this one will be. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try the uh, Salon Gel Polish on one hand, and then I'm gonna try the Gel Insta Strips on the other hand, and I will come back and let you know how it all turns out. Hey, it's your girl Renee, I'm back, and I want to show you what happened with the gel manicure. So first, I'll tell you about the Insta gel strips. I did it on this hand, 
Uh, the color is, what is the color? Shall we dance? And it's a starter kit. So I'm assuming, well, I'm sure that you will be able to go and get strips of whatever colors are available at your nearest store. Now the actual process was very simple. I just um, cleaned my nails, shaped them to the desired shape, and they give you a little tool that you can use. As you can see, I used it. I, I put my cuticles, I used my cuticle stick, and then after I cleaned them with the little packets, the new nail cleanser pad, I added the nail strips. Now, each packet is designed in this way. So it's really, it's a starter kit. So you get like one application pretty much. Again, I did it on one hand. And so I have one whole packet left, but you basically just choose the strip that fits your particular finger, place it on, make sure you go around the tip of your nail and then file it down. My nails are really short, so I just used my finger that was easier when I was putting on the actual strips. Um, but that process was simple. And then after you put the strips on, you go and you put on this top coat. This is the top coat, and that's the actual gel. And you do each finger individually, and you have this cute little lamp, let me show you, and you put your finger in like that, and the lamp has a timer, so it's automatic, 30 seconds for each finger and it shuts off. So you, you, you press the button, the light comes on, it shuts off, and then you go and you put the gel on the next finger and you put the finger in. So you do each finger individually, obviously, because this is a one finger production. Did I like it? Yes, I found it pretty easy to do. And if you are savvy enough, you could actually probably use these for more than one nail, particularly if your nails are as short as mine. Um, I really like it. I think that it came out really well. I mean, it's not perfect. I am not <laughs> a manicurist, but I am more than happy to go out with my nails looking like this every day. Nice and shiny. It's a nude color. I don't have to worry. Now, I am really looking forward to actually trying more colors. Speaking of which, I'm going to move on to the next one, which was the Sally Hansen Insta... Wait, what? I want to get the name correct. The, the Sally Hansen Salon Gel Polish. Now, this is more like the um, gel manicure that you would get when you go to an actual salon. Um, the Insta Gel, you know, that's just a quick put on the strips. But in this case, you actually have three different steps. Um, you have the base, you have your color, and you have your top coat. And in this instance, because this hand is a nude color, I decided to do this hand nude as well because I'm not gonna waste this manicure and go on and, and just go and take off the color or take off the gel that I just put on. It doesn't make sense to me. I'm not gonna be wasteful in that way. So I was happy to see that I could actually just go with nude nails but have a nice glossy shine. This is actually to me very, very nice. But let me tell you about the actual process. So again, the same way as before, you shape your nail, yeah, you're given a, a, a little emery board, um, and then what you do is you take the gray side and you buff all of the shininess off of your regular nails. So that's a little extra step that there is and that you didn't have. You clean the nail off with the gel pad, and then you apply the uh, base coat. And the base coat, this one, this is, and it has a number one, which is very nice. It's, it's very clearly labeled for you. And the base coat was just clear. And then you put your fingers in a larger version LED lamp. And you put all four fingers in like this. And again, it's only 30 seconds, so that dries. And then I put the, gel, uh, the uh, top coat on my thumb and then put my thumb in. And that's how they direct you to do it. And then after you do the base coat, you could follow up with color. In this case, it's a deep kind of wine-like color. I did not use it, but I am looking for it. It's called Why Not. I'm looking forward to using it because it looks really nice. Um, but I didn't do that. I just went ahead and put the third 
coat on, which is the actual gel. And the same way I did the top coat, I mean the bottom, the base coat, I just put it on top of the four nails, put them in 30 seconds. And again, this is automatic. And so it turns off when 30 seconds are up. And then I did my thumb. And I have to tell you, I love the way this looks. Absolutely love it. So I think both of these products, the Salon Insta Gel Strips, and the Salon Gel Polish are excellent choices. Uh, again, these are starter kits, so they just have, you know, basic, this is the a nude color for this starter kit, and this starter kit had the Why Not. Um, I would use both of them, just depending on time and personal preference. Honestly, if I had to pick which one I would use more often, it probably would be the actual gel polish kit and not the strips and that's just my personal preference i just kind of like the idea of putting the nail polish on my nails i find it soothing and comforting but both are perfectly good honestly um i found like trying to fit the strips on not challenging but it's not as neat whereas this is extremely neat of course if there were color involved i might have gotten the cuticles and if indeed that happens Make sure you clean your um, cuticles or the sides of your nails before curing because otherwise it's going to start peeling up as any gel manicure would. So I like both of them. I highly recommend both of them. I know that I'm going to be trying colors, uh, particularly since I can go for two weeks with the color. Uh, when I used to get my nails manicured professionally, I would just go with sort of like a color like this, like a nude, because I didn't want it to chip. But now that I have the Insta Gel and also the gel polish, I can go with something like Why Not and know that my nails are not gonna chip and they're gonna last for up to two weeks and I just have to take them off. Now, what's the taking off process? Well, the kit actually comes with acetone remover, the actual gel polish kit. And so you take a cotton ball, you soak it in the acetone and wrap it around each finger and you let it sit for 15 minutes. Again, it takes more time, but I think that that is definitely worth having beautiful nails for two weeks. And so my overall opinion, I say get at it. It's cheaper to, than actually going to the salon and getting your nails done in the gel. That's always a little bit more expensive than a regular manicure. And you get multiple uses out of it. I'm not sure of the exact price, so I don't want to misquote a price, but I will put the cost of both of these products in the bottom in the information area um, on, <laughs> on my video. So until next time, it's your girl Renee with spanking brand new gel manicure that I'm very excited about. And I can't wait to tell all my friends about it who haven't seen the video. Hopefully you'll tell your friends too. So until next time, it's your girl Renee with a brand new gel manicure.